and my aim for this week is to get to the China-Kazakhstan border. Um, it's about 650 kilometers away. So that's this week's goal. So that's another puncture. Seems to be about one a day since I've been riding in Xinjiang. Like maybe the the roads here have got more debris on them. Or maybe it's just because my back tire was so worn out. But no longer as my new tires arrived and I am now rolling on some fresh rubber. I've really not got as far as I wanted to get today. I'd planned to spend the night camping by this lake that's like up ahead. And in my head I'd find a really beautiful spot by the lake, set up my tent, get to watch the sunset go down over the lake. And um, it's just been so steep today. Like just brutal all day. So I've not made up anywhere near the distance to get to the lake. Probably got about an hour more daylight. I need to find somewhere to camp, but there's just this barrier and then this big barbed wire fence that runs along the side of the road. So I can't actually exit the road. So I'm going to need to keep going. It's such a beautiful spot that I was camping at last night, but I don't think you're actually allowed to camp here. Yeah. Um, so I'm going to get packed up now before anybody comes and tells you I'm not allowed to be here. That's my tent all packed up. I'm going to get some porridge cooked up and warm my hands on the stove because it's absolutely freezing. Well, I had to ride for the night to get here and it's freezing cold but I'd say it was well worth it for this camping spot in this view. So I'm going to get packed up now, get on the road, try and make it to the border today. That's me heading out today after a night camp at the lake. Um, about 115 kilometers to the border. So all going well, no troubles. I should make that today.
So I made it to the border of China and Kazakhstan. Uh, got myself a hotel, gonna get a shower, wash some clothes, relax, get some food before starting the real adventure and crossing into Central Asia in a couple of days' time.